All right, welcome to week number three of This Week in Foolishness. I am here with uh, Nicole. Hey, hey. And Brendan. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, Joe's oh, absent hey. tonight hey. due to family. Uh, <laughs> Son of a bitch! <laughs> due to family <laughs> stuff. So he's having dinner with his brother-in-law. So it's just the three of us, which is just fine, because we're funnier than Joe anyway. So, yes. um... <laughs> <laughs> Brennan's getting up and telling us to be quiet. I opened that because of the smoke. I'm closing it because of the road traffic. Sorry. Okay, then open up that one. That's farther away. Just don't, like, break my bike. Continue. I'm totally going to break it. I sh you break that bike, you owe me $300. <laughs> That's it? That's, well, I got, it at, I got it at Rick's. He is literally already I'm sure shit. he is. <laughs> and my second mic's in there, too. Which you break. <laughs> We're fine. Nothing broke. Nothing fell. I usually don't care about the smoke, but there's three of us in here, so. I'm not smoking. I, yeah, but that's because you're lame. lame. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like if it's just me and Kate, like we'll smoke and it doesn't matter. And then it, like, it, does it ever smell like smoke in here? It smells like your sh fucking that's douche. Bag oh shit. Oh well, that's yeah, all that's because I, I opened it. <laughs> Oh, that smells good. Get some, that no, smells you like, get some like strawberry or watermelon. How do you know? How do you know? I it's, don't like the smell of that. It's prickly pear. It smells like shit it's coming out of your fucking gay ass mouth. <laughs> it's so good. It's fucking fruity. I'm sure it smells so, fine beforehand, but once it comes out of your mouth, right, it's so, probably so, just got all the fucking thumb <laughs> in there. So to reel it back in, uh, this week is our holiday week. We are going to do some holiday uh, stories. Everything from Christmas, New Year's, Thanksgiving, Halloween... Anything else? Yeah. How, how was everyone's Christmas this year, by the way? It just happened, so... Jake, was your Christmas okay? Oh, yeah, it was just <laughs> fine and dandy. Kate? Super dandy. All I right. played Jenga you and I won. You didn't say her name of, Oh, wait, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't fucking know what her name is. Nicole! <laughs> oh, you said Kate, oh, and I shit. put that in my head. This is the first time We're I met her. I'm come up with a nickname. It's not gonna be Kate, though. Nicole. No. <laughs> I got it. No. I'll remember now. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so that's how we're starting the show, guys. Yeah, that's, 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 we're three minutes in. <laughs> Already off All right. track. Already. <laughs> hey, man. Nothing. This show has no rules. Exactly. <laughs> um, it's not like our show affects anyone anyway. It's not popular <laughs> yet. Give it time. After this story, it might be. Who was the rug? Uh, it was on the other one. I feel Fuck. like I need a porn hub to be dubbed in. Oh, shit. Somehow. <laughs> for my story. Oh, oh so, um, Nicole and I were talking on the way over here. You mean Kate? No. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> so, we were talking on the way over here that y you're the YouTube guy. Yeah. Uh, so, I think either next week or the week after, we're going to try and uh, simulcast on YouTube. All right. That way, because she wants to do some stuff with callers. That can come, in, that can call in or whatever. My, my mom would, my mom would yeah. like to call in because she's not always up here all the time. So yeah. she's got stories to boot on just about anything. Did she listen to the I mom stories? In different yeah, she did. Well, she knew what was. She knew. What was. I got all the hoes in all different area codes. So <laughs> Ludacris would be proud. Ludacris would be proud. <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you, had, you couldn't resist. You could not resist. I could. I could. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, I never like to start, so who wants to go first? You go first. Oh, why the... Because... All right, I'll go first. I, I feel weird going first as the host, but I mean, whatever. I'll go first. I don't give a shit. All right, okay. Nicole, I'll go first. All right. What do you want first, Thanksgiving or Halloween? Whatever. All whatever, right, whatever so Halloween. Want. A couple years back, I go trick-or-treating in Lancaster with my eight-year-old. He's now eight. Um, okay, I'm gonna... This is gonna be, like, bad mom... Real bad mom. No, nobody's <laughs> judging you here. <laughs> 2018 right. does not exist in this bubble. Right. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. so, there's this house that we go to, and I'm terrified of clowns, bro. Like, terrified. <laughs> I hate them. I don't fucking Fuck care them. who you are. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Fuck them. So, there's this house where my sister knows this dude that lives there, and he dressed up like a clown every year. I'm pretty sure he does, like, Fright World and shit, or Fright right. Fest, or whatever the oh, fuck it is. No. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Just get used to it. I'm actually one. really good at it. <laughs> he didn't have that last time. I didn't have it. Joe had it, and he's like, a what minute you, late. What and we're like, do? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so um, there's 
this dude that dressed up like a clown and my sister thinks it's fucking hilarious. This motherfucker chased me halfway down the street. Oh. I'm not even playing it. Yes. I was like in tears. Though. I would have in tears. I literally would have turned around and just fucking put my foot in the oh, I was so pissed. <laughs> or just would turn around and just knee strike front on. Just right. watch them cripple to the ground. Oh. <laughs> It was so stupid. I fucking hate clowns. Clown, dude. Clowns at Fright oh. Fest don't bother me because I know like they're paid to be there. But like, if I was out like this year, like Kate and I went trick or treating with her five year old, right down on my dad's street. If a clown would have came out and was chasing us down the street, I would have beat that clown's <laughs> ass <laughs> or died trying because it's like fuck that. No, I never it's understood. Like clowns the news and shit too. Yeah. Like, well, that the was fuck? right before the <laughs> it movie yeah, came out. Dude. I never understood the fear of clowns and people. There's a lot of people afraid okay. of clowns. Let me back up and tell you why I'm afraid of clowns. Oh, here we go. Back when I was younger, <laughs> okay, I was like, I have a picture of it. I was like <laughs> I six, seven years old. My niece or my cousin had a birthday party and she had a clown there. Skittles was his name. Skittles. Oh, she she you a, not. That's a harmless name. You would think. Who fucking doesn't love okay. Skittles? Okay. Couple years later, same dude. Skittles is here. <laughs> same dude got arrested for fucking raping a child. Oh, so, come on, all right. so then DNL plays the top. She used to have a clown every Sunday, and I will never forget this because my sister used to live right down the street. Me and her boyfriend's sister would walk down the tops every fucking day and go get what they want because we were like the maids of the house. So we would go to tops. And this fucking clown was there, and he was doing, like, balloon animals and shit, and he was like, yo, come here, check this out. And I was like, nah, fuck you. <laughs> and <laughs> I was like, I was like, 13, some shit like that, 14, and this motherfucker chased me through tops, and he was like, come back, I bite. Come back, I bite. I was like, what? <laughs> no. So I don't like clowns ever since. Alright, all right, so back. a few come bad experiences with clowns. <laughs> yeah. Uh, a few bad people making clowns have bad names, you know. I'm I don't know, man. I was like, never trust a clown named Skittles. No, <laughs> never trust a person who's like, I'm a professional clown. Period. Just like, like if you're in the entertainment business to entertain children, I probably don't trust you because that's just fucking weird. I don't know about that. Like, you don't like to entertain children? Well, I don't. No, I, don't I hate, like I it that outside. way. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, no. <laughs> but like, like I don't like clowns. Like when I was a I was probably, like, four or five, like, I remember we were living in West Falls, and, like, my mom, like, decorated my room with, like, stuffed animals and stuff. I had, like, this stuffed, creepy-ass clown doll that, like, I can still, like, I can close my eyes and still Like the one from it. the poltergeist? I don't even remember what that looks like, if you want to pull it up for me. Um, I can still close my eyes and picture the creepy-ass, like, it's it was, like, one of those, like, flat, like, dolls where it's just so, inf- oh, it's got it. And ever since that, it's, clowns kind of creep me out. It's it is what it is, but <laughs> well, that's just just the truth. No, no, no. Did you see the new It movie? No, fuck no. Come on. Why the fuck would I have watched that? I watched the first one and I hid behind my boyfriend at the time. <laughs> I hid behind him and I like closed my it eyes. Was, and it was it was really good. It was really good. I actually haven't seen it yet either. Right my, now. All right, movie so, night. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so on with your your Halloween story. All right, so after this clown fucking chases me halfway down the street, we end up coming up to another house where they have, like, a haunted house set up on their porch and shit. Mm -hmm. So I'm in there with my kid and my sister, and I walk around the corner, and there's a fucking clown. (laughs) I'm not even fucking playing. It was his brother. I was like, what the fuck, dude? And it scared the shit out of me. So what did I do? I fucking pushed my kid into the clown net. Oh, oh my god. god! Yo, I bolted the other way. I was like, he's out. <laughs> you know? Oh, my, your kid hates clowns. <laughs> yes, he does. Oh, God. And he tells me all the time that Pennywise is coming. <laughs> your son does? Because he watched it with us, the first one. Oh, God. The first one <laughs> yeah. was creepy as shit. I literally pushed my kid into a clown. <laughs> so, like, Jesus. That's oh. my more. <laughs> so, I know you're a movie buff. I'm a movie buff. Mm-hmm. You like so like, my cousin used to do a podcast um, named Movie Marathoners. Uh-huh. Uh, like maybe we could do a variation of that every every month or something of like you know talking about like our favorite genre of movie. We'll do a different so genres. My, my friend Brian comes in handy for horror movies. Yeah, Shout like, out to him. love <laughs> horror movies. Brittany oh, yeah. definitely want to do that. Oh she yeah, loves horror movies. Yeah. Friend. Comedy movies, man. Oh, comedy. All the Mel, uh, Mel Brooks. Mel Brooks, yeah. Uh, Some Harry Monty Python. Shit. Oh, God. <laughs> we, could, we could do, like, we could do like reviews of dumb rom-coms. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Go. 
I still didn't see Super Troopers 2 yet. No, I haven't either. Good. I haven't good. either. Joe and I went to go see it in theaters. It was really good. I've been falling behind in my movie yeah, adventures. I haven't. I haven't, <laughs> I haven't had internet, dude. I just moved into my place, so I haven't had internet or privileges <laughs> to do- illegally download movies, okay? <laughs> Who that doesn't, doesn't happen. Who doesn't use the pirate page? <laughs> right, like, who doesn't know the proxy site? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so you, you threw your kid in to the clown, and that, that was and it. And I fucking bolted. Did my bolted? sister brought him through the rest of it. Oh my god! So you just abandoned <laughs> the rest of the night. I abandoned ship, dude. I was like, nope. Man. Yeah, shit. that was bad. <laughs> 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 so there's one holiday story that poor for you. Kid. <laughs> so... Uh, Brennan, why don't you do one of yours, and then we'll, we'll loop back around. Um, well, I have, <laughs> I don't have any, uh, stories of me throwing kids in the fucking clowns or anything No, like you that. just, you just claim you as a kid and ran away. No, yeah, no, well, <coughs> I was actually, uh, as a kid, the uh, one probably <laughs> dressing up and trying to scare people. So when you, you did have a good, did you ever uh, get punched in the face? No. <laughs> you did you did have a good Halloween costume this year. Yeah, this you, year this year you're, I, you're very tall and you you did a really good Mike Myers this year. Yeah, I did. I did Mike Myers. Uh we did it at my cousin's girlfriend's mother's house. That's a mouthful. Uh it was uh you know, big suburban cul-de-sac area and th- so many fucking kids. There had been over yeah. 200 fucking kids in that place. Did you just like peek out around bushes and was like I was, I, pretty, <laughs> I, I, I remain <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this is what I learned as a kid like if you truly want to scare somebody, you remain completely stationary. Make it look like you're not real. They think you're a dummy and oh, then the last the fucking <laughs> second. Yes, they walk up to you in the last fucking second you move. Oh my god. Dude, I just had, a slight I had too. adults coming up to me. Uh, like, as, is he real? Can I get a picture with him? I don't like, think I can oh my stand God, still that long. Am- I, I've done it for years. I, I don't really <laughs> make an imprint in the world, so. <laughs> <laughs> you did really just stand there and put chips on the shelf. That is true. <laughs> <laughs> you just moved your arms. Yeah. Why do you think they're this big? All those chips. All oh, those big Your bear. muscle's not in your bicep. It's in your fucking forearm. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. You probably I was talking did, like, about the, the whip and nene button. really good, right? Uh, uh, I don't even know what that dance is. Oh my the what? God. The whip and nene. Oh! He probably does it. He probably does I know the song. I know of it. I don't you know what it looks like. Have you seen like. all the morons doing it? I'm sure I have. I but. feel like we're going to have a dance show soon, Oh, guys. Jesus. <laughs> That'll be on the live stream. <laughs> oh. Hell yeah, well. So, <laughs> yeah, that was just your dressed up as uh, Michael Myers and the kids and adults all wanted pictures it was it was a good I told time you ne- i told you next year you should start building your costume now you should do jason. oh yeah you should I, do I was thinking about it we I should just jason. make our own fucking haunted house in like a field and shit like well a maze or here's something here's going to the people. actual story i'm gonna tell is when i was little uh my mother worked at briarwood country club here in hamburg and mm-hmm. every year during halloween we were allowed to do like a little haunted house kind of thing so she ran it was it filled with scary stick figures like your halloween decoration this year it could have been. some Blair Witch shit. No, <laughs> we, we, we would make our own he, stuff. He literally, he literally made... <coughs> no, all right, no. Sure. I'll show her. I'll show her. He, it, it turned out good, but when he's making it, he went and bought, like, one-inch PVC pipe. No. And just, like, made the frame. And he's like, my Halloween decoration. I was like, that's one scary... That's what it ended up with. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's I was like, okay. That's sweet, though. I'm like, that's one scary stick figure. <laughs> he's like, fuck But, yeah, you're, you're right. It, before we did it, it was literally just PVC pipes. Yeah. Stuck it looked like a stick. <laughs> Uh, so we were able to do this haunted house, and my mother was in charge of the whole thing. And basically, we decorated the whole upstairs of this big building. We we're allowed to do the whole thing. Um, you know, people, members of the club, and everything would come through, and we, that was basically my trouble. It was scaring people. Yeah, that's that's what I did. Um, you scare people now. No, I know. They, they just <laughs> got to get one look at me, and it's good. But no, that's that's what I did as a kid, and, and it wasn't just that. Like my uh, father. And my uncle would always do up my grandmother's house. Uh, they went all out when they made all their own decorations. Very artistic. And that's basically where I got my side of the talent from with my stick figure. <laughs> <laughs> As uh, basically from my family just growing up. Ha- Halloween's one of my favorite holidays. It's what I love to do best. And that's, yeah, that's it. But nothing, nothing crazy. I've never had any crazy stories. Uh, Man, I don't have a cool story. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I got... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> so if anyone's listening from the area and cool they've story, been bro. to, uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, you know, Broward Country Club back in, like, the early 2000s, 90s, late 90s, or whatever, um, you would have seen me there, and it, that's basically what that was. Cool. It was us. So now, what's your story? 
That was the story. That was the story. I told you I didn't have anything good this year. <laughs> Shit, dude, I really am taking the show. This time. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> that was that was. It's got to the table with. Yeah, it was Michael I Myers, Michael and I used Myers. to do. I told you. I, to I told you I didn't have anything yeah. crazy. I could have pulled someone off the street for this episode. I had a story. I think I was like fourteen. I had some old guy saying I shouldn't have been trick or treating because well, yeah, I was too oh big. God, Everyone says it. Yeah. But I still right, look like a child, so like it works. We st- <coughs> There's a lady that still lives on my dad's street. We call her the fat lady because she's super fat and bitchy to everyone. And wow, that's rude. We, whatever. Who fuck cares? Dude, you <laughs> no, know? literally, she was like, she was like the neighborhood police. Oh. Right. Anything you did, anything you did, she would bitch about. And then one year they got like this really big like Halloween blow up and put it on the front lawn. And my dad's next door neighbor goes, "Oh, I see the ladies out on the front lawn." <laughs> 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 she's just like. She's like <laughs> so, it, and like, she would call the cops constantly on my dad for his oh, dogs barking. What a bitch. Constantly. They're dogs. They yeah. bark. <laughs> no. Yeah. So, and then my dad's next door neighbor who's like really good friends with us. And like, that's my buddy Mike's dad. Um, I've mentioned him. Uh, yeah, he's like a super tall one. I think I mentioned him on the first one. He was the one with the super cheap wouldn't buy a new hockey stick. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. So I mentioned him on the first one. His, so his dad would drive by and just like, he's got, he'd had motorcycles all our life. Yeah. So he would just drive by and just fucking rip it in front of her. <laughs> <laughs> the one year he ripped it loud enough to get her car alarm to go off. Oh, shit. <laughs> so I guess I'll go next with one of my stories. Um, mine's a Christmas story. Uh, I was a very intelligent kid. It peaked right about there. You were super intelligent that we met in summer school. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like I said, it peaked when I was like five. (laughs) It was my intelligence. So I, probably since like the age of five, didn't believe in Santa. Like ruined my mom's like life of me growing up as a kid. Just she was like, tried everything to get me to believe. Nothing. And she loves Christmas. Christmas and Halloween, she loves um, so the one year I'm like four or five, we're living in West Falls. And so she decides Christmas morning, she hides all my presents, hides all of them, puts them behind the couch. And she puts like two Barbies and like a bunch of coal underneath the, <laughs> <laughs> the tree. And I walk out and I'm just like, where are the presents, mom? <laughs> I'm just like, I was like, really? And I like, I just look around the house. <laughs> and they behind the couch and she's like damn it she's like you ruined my Christmas <laughs> I'm not believing <laughs> so from that on like Christmas was nothing and, like I knew that like the Easter Bunny wasn't really either because like she took me when I was young and like you know he's got the suit on well like the gloves are separate so I could see his watch <laughs> he has the Rolex how was he yeah. part of that um Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I checked my watch. <laughs> so that like, she just she just didn't like that I and then like she'd make me put the tree up when I was like a little older like we had fake tree or whatever and that's why like I do not do Christmas like it's just Christmas became so mundane of me putting up the Christmas tree every year decorating it whatever <laughs> like and I think that was like her payback of me not believing in Santa Claus and letting her get the joy of it. That she just made me put the Christmas tree up every year, and now it's ruined my Christmas ever. Because, like, I just don't put a tree up, and I don't decorate. Like, I didn't even decorate the tree with my girlfriend this year. Oh my she, God. she, well, like, she ended up just saving it for, like, when her kids came into town, and, like, they did it all together. So I was like, eh, it's fine. So, uh, what do you got next? <laughs> I got Thanksgiving next. Um, but I need to go back to Halloween for a minute, because right. I just came up with the best fucking costume for you two. Oh, yeah? yeah. Oh, boy. So, you know, like, Freak show circuses? Yeah. yeah. The bearded lady. Uh, <laughs> you gotta, gotta work for him. Gotta do it. Yeah, he, he grows a beard and he looks like Watto from fucking <laughs> Star Wars. Perfect. Why don't you pull a picture of that up? Perfect. <laughs> you don't know what Watto looks like? I do, but maybe she doesn't. I you know have every Star like? Wars movie. Thank you. Okay. Thank I just, you. I don't know. <laughs> I knew who he like. I knew who he was, but I didn't know his name until I looked you him up to make that really joke. fucking nerdy. I have a wall dedicated to Star Wars. <coughs> oh, okay. Look at my living room. And the Iron like, Man and Captain America. No, no, no. That, <laughs> my <laughs> wall. Oh, look, a my huge... wall does not have anything on. Oh shit! All right. Yeah. All right. Well, there's there's more now, but that's what it. Holy was. shit! You guys yeah. are super nerds. It's awesome. Yeah. No. That's yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah. All right. 
Action! <laughs> <laughs> so Thanksgiving, we're going back a couple years again because I haven't hung out with my family in a while, and I hope to God that they are listening to this because they're going to fucking kill me for telling the story. <laughs> All right. Excellent. So. Oh, God. <laughs> I fucking hate you. So, Literally a visceral skin crawl when you do that voice. I feel like this is where we need Pornhub. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> You'll understand after oh, I tell it. Oh, okay. God. So, now my uncle turkey. is passed away. He passed away. Like, I'm sorry, that wasn't something. Ago. That was <laughs> <laughs> but, um, okay, so when he was alive, we had Thanksgiving with my family. And before we even go to dinner, we're all sitting at my kitchen table me, my sister, my mom, my stepdad. And we're talking about, like, those sexual terms. You know what I'm talking about? Like, yeah. Like, steamroller and fucking yeah. Dutch oven and stupid okay. shit like that, okay? <laughs> right? So, I'm telling my mom what they all mean. And she's like, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> so then this bitch goes... I remember in high school, goes, we would talk about this, like, yeah. in art class. We'd just be like, like, art class was nothing. Dude, we would do some crazy <laughs> shit in high school. <laughs> but, um, so my mom asked me out of nowhere... Well, what the fuck is a dirty Sanchez? <laughs> I'm like, what? I'm like, Mom, ask that at dinner. Ask Uncle Jay. So, we're continuing these conversations. And then we finally leave to go to my family's house. And we're at my aunt's house, sitting at the table. It's fucking silent. Dead-ass silent. And my mom screams over from another table, because we had two tables. Family's pretty big. And she goes, dead silent. She goes... Hey, Jay, what the fuck is a dirty Sanchez? <laughs> it's from my entire family. My entire fucking family. I'm like, Mom! <laughs> I'm like, Mom, you can't just ask that. I was not being serious when I said to ask that. So he tells her, and her face just goes from laughing to like, Pure what horror. the fuck, dude? What did I just get myself into? She's like, so Shut then, up. <laughs> you know. So then, a couple days goes by, and we think nothing of it. And I have my brand new laptop. I had a Sony Bio pink one. And I'm on YouTube and shit. And my stepdad asked me why, uh, what the fuck is two girls, one cup? <laughs> oh, God. I'm you, like, no, uh, no. So, you know what's funny? is like I've actually never watched that video. Be thankful. Oh, just be me. thankful. So I played it for him in the middle of my kitchen table. Oh, for everybody that walks you know, by to see. I may have seen worse recently. <laughs> but it gets what? worse. You know, like, that's like I know what it is, but, like, I've never seen it. But, like. What were you finding? Okay, like, I wasn't like, searching I, like, for I anything. Say, I can say I've seen worse. Did you like get aroused by it? Because no, that would be even no, worse. No, no, Because like, I can no. say I've seen worse because Listen, I watch, right, I watch so like, I got invited. invitation. You, you know no, no, hold, you, hold on, hold on, hold <laughs> on. I can say I've seen worse because you know I watch like, ex, like, yes. like accident videos and yeah, invitation okay. videos. That's and, what like, I was just getting on about. So, like, so <laughs> you invited me to that grotesque group or whatever. <laughs> so really, I've seen some weird shit in that. Well, somebody else I knew that I worked with at the other place that just left, uh, before I left, invited me to his group. Okay. And he's got a bunch of people that post some pretty horrible shit. And uh, I've seen something worse. I, like, I, I remember that... I've seen I something worse than two girls, one cup. I don't know how I stumbled across this uh, page on Facebook, but it's wasn't all, sound. like, remember factory accidents, sound. like, beheading videos... Like car accident videos, like that dude that shot his brains out in the one video. Yeah, like, like in front of everybody. Yeah, yeah. Like the one, the one I saw was like this guy was laying on the ground. He was like knocked out or something. This was like the first video I remember seeing on it, and it it was like it looked like it was in some third world country. And they hold on, we are. Yeah, hold on. So <laughs> that's the he's, one. He's you can laying, watch it when you're ready. He's laying on the ground, just like. <laughs> Like this, and they literally just pull out a sawed-off shotgun and blow his face in. Yeah. Just, you, you see, and you're like, that's not movie. That's, yeah. I've seen them where, like, the president and shit got shot and stuff, like, in oh, the car yeah. and shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, but I, I watched right there, one. Just hit play. This looks like someone got filleted. Wait, You'll so see. after, after, uh, Two Girls, One Cup, me and my set there are staring at, like, staring at it with our fucking jaws dropped, like, how many times can you say you watched yeah. like, Two Girls, One Cup, especially with your family, Okay. So then, I can I come across the one where the dude what fucking the blows up. <laughs> I turned the volume down, but just wait. No, turn it up because I, I feel like we need. No, the, there's sound. I'm I hoping there's oh not my sound. God. That is not two girls one cup. No, <laughs> no, it's like. Why do you have this? That's, I told you it's in a group. <laughs> It's in a group chat that he's in. Like, oh my god! You know, people get off to that. Oh, oh. Fuck, oh. 
that's that's a Houston fact. That's, that's, that's what it is. That's more than a Houston she, fact. She's going to the game show tomorrow. That is Lockport oh. for you. Oh my god. Yeah, welcome oh. to Lockport. <laughs> no. no, that's, oh, that's like Niagara Falls. Niagara Falls <laughs> shit. All right. So Jesus after Christ. we watched Two Girls One Cup, I came across the one. You know, it's like something about pain. I forgot what it's called, but it's where the dude like ties off his dick and. Oh like, yeah, he, BME you know, pain. Yes, yeah, dude. We watched that, and I was Why? like, What the fuck? Why? So then after we watched that, we're watching the reactions and shit. That's like the reactions. That's like. Uh, was it two guys one hammer where they like yeah they the guy yes, out in the yes. woods and like beat him with a hammer okay I've never like, seen I that <laughs> that's Germany, Germany yeah yo that's my spit on your grave shit Okay. Oh. So there was my Continue. Thanksgiving story. <laughs> so that's the that's, that's Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I have a oh. pretty interesting life, guys. God, yeah. <laughs> it's nothing different than what we see. <laughs> like, like. Let's go to a happier note. <laughs> happier. Come on. Um. <laughs> I think that's all I got for Thanksgiving, guys. <laughs> I got two girls in one cup and Dirty Sanchez. <laughs> <laughs> God. Jesus Christ. So what, what's your... <laughs> can you top my story? No, I can't. There's no fucking way I'll ever... You can't Michael Myers over there. I cannot no top topping. anything. Like, no I'll topping. just I'll just be Michael Myers right now and not talk for the rest of the night. <laughs> Please? <laughs> I feel like that's your new nickname. We're going to start calling you Myers. Michael uh, Myers? Yeah. No, I like that. I like that. I don't get along with doing? Michaels. Don't touch things. Me and Michaels don't get along. <laughs> Listen, shut up and do what I tell you. <laughs> I got peaks going off the board over here because we're laughing so loud. My nipples look like milk duds. No. Oh my God. You know what that's from? You should know what that's from. They probably from. do. <laughs> I, don't know why. I don't even. I don't know. I think you just stopped my story. I don't know why. <laughs> like, that was just, it was just shit out your mouth. Like, this, like, <laughs> All right, uh, Christmas. Um, so my dad uh, has watched one, A Christmas Story and National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation so much that he honestly thinks that he is uh, those people. And I never caught on to this because when I was little, I, yeah, I've seen the movies, but I didn't watch them closely. Okay. Uh, I didn't realize this until recently that my dad pulled that shit on me, the, A Christmas Story with the fucking BB gun. <laughs> he did that shit to me and I didn't even hit on to it. Okay, so I in the movie, say, like, yeah, like, what, what, what you try out? No, 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 no. Like, <laughs> I mean, you even change a tire and you yell fuck. fuck. Like, <laughs> like, there's no, so no, much no, that happened in the movie. The, the, the whole yeah. getting the BB gun thing, like the whole uh, hiding behind the tree, all this shit. Like, oh, okay. he, he he went on like he played it exactly like the movie. I never caught on until like literally last year. I realized he fucking did that to me, that motherfucker. Like he he's me and him don't really see eye to eye. We're not. I told you it's not going to top that story. I, I don't have fucking crazy just, like, these stories like that. But, uh, you know, he, he pulled the, a Christmas story to me. The fucking, uh, you were talking about how you would use fake trees every year. No, we had to go out to the middle of fucking nowhere and cut that tree down every year. <laughs> we, every fucking year. My, my dad did that for a lot of years, and then... We were like, yeah, we're tired of driving to Springville to get a tree. And no, no, he and then, never grew tired. We'll right he, I think he even yeah. like, this year he had a tree, uh, a real tree without... You know, oh, I do have a bra. A bra. 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 Yeah. Bra. <laughs> no, but um, what was it? Yesterday I was watching Ren and Stimpy, and I was watching The Son of Stimpy, the, the Christmas episode with the fart. <laughs> okay. I just, that was one of the first cassettes I think I got for Christmas was that. Um, you still have that, a VCR? Back then. Oh, you no, said I, yesterday. Well, yeah, I have it on <laughs> digital copy now, but no, back then that was the first movie. He like he bought it for me for Christmas one year, and we watched that. So I watched it again this year. I thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> listen, listen, I, I like running Stimpy, man. I'm sorry. Stop laughing, you idiot! Fuck off! <laughs> oh, what I am going to do to you? Fuck off! I feel like you sound more like Pinky in the Brain than Ernest Stimpy. I suppose. Fuck. It, it takes a. Uh, uh, sometimes it gets there, sometimes it don't, so. <laughs> he still cringes every time I do it. it, it going back to the story of the first uh, episode. Yeah, uh, we're joking. Apparently, his uncle. <laughs> pull down your pants! No! Oh my god, please it's don't! Not what <laughs> oh my god! Fuck! <laughs> You're getting raped by you. <laughs> Someone oh, oh, watching Ren and Stimpy. Yeah, that, that was the allegations that Joe, <laughs> Joe had. They might be true. Yeah, yeah, they might be. I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, 
I don't. That's gonna be like a reoccurring theme of this podcast, I believe, is that Joe's gonna be like, <laughs> you guys <laughs> read. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Uh, yeah. No, I don't have good good no, holiday you, you, stories. You don't. No, I told you, man. Let's just be clear on that. Starting off, suck. walking in the door, I said my stories are gonna suck. They're gonna be more cutesy than fucking. Uh, How many more do you have? have? Oh, that was probably. It. Oh, I'll think of something we else. We should buy him sure. a fucking bunny suit from A Christmas Story. You know they're selling those right oh, now at Walmart. Yeah, I know they are. I, know, I thought you were gonna tell me like from Donnie Darko. <laughs> oh my God, I love Donnie Darko. <laughs> That is a future Maybe he can get hit by a car. Oh, shit. So, like, my last story is... your turn. (laughs) I'm really going to punch you today. Uh. (laughs) My story is a New Year's Eve story. So, uh... For the sake of the story, we'll say I was of age. Um, <laughs> <He's just kidding. laughs> Nobody's ever of age. Yeah. Uh, we, we went to a party. Still isn't of age. We went to a party of a family friend, and like we were just getting hammered, hammered, and long, long night. Lots and lots of food. I just say long story short. <laughs> no, no, lots, and lots and lots of food. <laughs> Tons of beer and like any booze you can think of. So. Like, after the ball drops, someone gets the idea that, like, yo, let's play uh, Nerf War. Yes. And my, yes. the, the the family friends at the house was, they, they were two guys, lived together, they were, you know, friends from high school and stuff. They had a giant box of just Nerf guns. Dude, I have a huge <laughs> like, fucking Every game. Nerf gun you can think of. And these it. these guys were in their, like, 30s. And they're just, like, Nerf There's guns. There's nothing wrong with that at all. <laughs> I have the so, advantage because I can say I bought that shit for my kid and I really bought it for me. <laughs> you have an alibi. I got the Nerf oh, yeah. rival guns and everything. Oh, so <laughs> those are actually pretty cool because they shoot they like fucking hurt. They shoot like the ball and yeah, like, dart. yeah, dude. Like, we didn't, we didn't have those. So anyway, we too, like too old. They were yeah back then. <laughs> back then it was still this dart. So we all like run in and grab like grab whatever guns we can get and darts we can carry. We all just hide throughout the house. The full house, and we're. We're just shooting everyone, picking up darts, shooting and shooting. And I don't remember who it was. Just rounded the corner and the gun in my face and just goes, <laughs> boom! <laughs> right in the eye. And I'm just like, like, You'll shoot your eye out, kid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm literally like, I'm like, oh, shit. And like, remember that Dane Cook? Uh, oh, yeah. Where he's like, ah, piss in the eye. <laughs> yeah. Not good. That's pretty much what it was. And I was like, I think I was like on the stairs and I just like kind of like rolled back down the stairs. And I was like, <laughs> I'm like, fuck! And, like, I don't think I ever... T- I, we haven't told this story yet. But, like, when I was a kid, probably, like, six or seven, my dad was splitting wood. And I was outside hanging out with him, playing in the dirt and whatever. And he's splitting wood with a wood splitter. And, like, a piece of... Tiny piece of wood flies off and, like, sticks in my eye. <laughs> sticks in my eye. I'm just picturing it. <laughs> yeah. So, my dad... Like, we, like, my dad just thought it was, like... It was dirt. Like, it was really small. It was... And my dad was like, oh, it's dirt, whatever. He takes me back home to my mom, and, like, my eyes, like, all crusted <laughs> over. And, like, my mom's like, what the fuck? <laughs> so, she... Just rub it out. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, we go, to the ho- we go to the hospital, and they, like, they try to get it out. Oh, no, first, they put me on, like, this little thing where you put your chin on, and she's got, like, um, basically, like, a microscope looking in my eye. Yeah. And she's trying to take this piece of wood chip out of my eye with, like, a hypodermic needle. <laughs> like, oh my god. Yeah. And she like stabs me in the eye. <laughs> and she's like, she's like, I can't do this. Like, oh. just like freaks out and like makes us leave because she like stabbed me in the eye. Oh my god. <laughs> like, so So then like we go to like a different doctor and they're like, oh yeah, we can get it out. They literally like strap me down on like one of those emery boards. <laughs> and like my mom's like super upset because like I'm freaked out. And I've already been stabbed in the eye. I'm strapped to this board. My mom's sitting there like just holding my fingers because that's all she can, like, hold on to. <laughs> and they, like, finally get it out. And then fast forward, like, another, like, five, six years, I'm playing. You're blind. No, no, <laughs> actually, I'm not blind. Uh, I can see just fine, unfortunately. <laughs> um, so, you know, he's looking at Brendan. Yeah. Like, <laughs> I'm a fucking look. I mean, shit. <laughs> So, fast forward a few more years, I'm playing outside 
just doing whatever, playing with sticks like a, you know, 10 year old would do. I somehow, like, catch myself in the eye with a stick, like, under the eyelid. Again? Yeah. Under what the, the eyelid. What the fuck with you? <laughs> under the eyelid. This goes on. This goes on. So, like, this is going to lead into, like, the story. You know, my mom, we go to the doctors or whatever. They're like, oh, he just scratched underneath his eyelid. Like, whatever. Fast forward probably another... It was probably about another six years. I was 16, whatever. I'm screwing around soldering shit. I think I told you this story. I don't remember. Guess what? Your time is coming for you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, I'm soldering stuff, and, like, I was just screwing around. Like, I don't remember what I was soldering, but, like, it popped and, like, exploded. <laughs> splattered. Some hot solder. Solder splattered in my <laughs> eye. Oh, and, my and like, oh, I'm, like, I'm, like, 15, 16, so I'm staying home alone after school, whatever. Like, I'm fucking around with shit. My mom's working. So, like, I call my mom, and she's like, I'm at work. <laughs> like, what do you want me to do? So my grandma comes and, like, picks me up. We gotta go to the doctor's. Like, we go to the emergency room, and they're like... Bring an ambulance. <laughs> <laughs> I need an ambulance. <laughs> so, like, take me to the doctor's. They literally, like, hold my eye open, like, clockwork orange, and, like, are scraping my eye oh, with a scalpel. And <laughs> I had to wear an eye at school for, like, three days. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Three days. Yeah. All right, so, like, okay, fast forward... <laughs> to the to you the just, back. You just ruined our entire show next week. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no! I didn't. Because I got worse. <laughs> so oh my god! Back, back to the party. I get shot in the eye, and I'm like, oh shit! Here it is, all over again. I was like, gonna have to go to the hospital, whatever. I'm like, oh my I'm like, I don't even want to look out of it. And I'm just like, everyone's like, I'm laying down there. And they're like, is he okay? I'm like, I got shot in the eye. <laughs> And, I and, it was, and it was like a mixture. It was like a mixture between like, of like the blunt ended darts and the suction cup darts. So I didn't know, I didn't know, what, I, I, I didn't know what I got hit with, and it like it felt like I got like my eye got scratched. So I'm like, shit. Long story short, it was fine, but it was like I literally got hit and I'm just fall down the stairs and, and just like, rest of the night I just drank. And drank and drank and then <laughs> just passed out. So the pain was gone. Yeah. It, was, it wasn't even painful. It was you wear glasses, right? You were irritated. What? You're like, some days you wear glasses? No. Oh, I thought you no. have glasses. I'm the blind bitch here. Uh, no. I, actually, I actually see really good. It's just been recently... Except in those eyes. <laughs> it's, it's only been recently... Only looking at you. Yeah. <laughs> recently I started getting migraines, and now I have a permanent floater in my left eye that's like... Just below that. That's just center. cancer. Good I'm gonna get that checked at. Yeah. <laughs> so I don't know what it is, but I'm just like whatever. Yeah, I might want to get that looked at. Yeah. Whatever. <laughs> I don't want to get hit in the eye again. Just, just yeah. wait for it. It'll happen. It's coming through. I, I got. <laughs> yeah, you're due for how, how long ago was it? Six years. <laughs> uh, yeah, about pretty. You do. I'm you're trying due. to think if I've you been what? hit in the eye recently. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure we could find something around here. <laughs> I'll fuck up for it. I don't want to end up like the guy from Pirates of the Caribbean where he's got a fork in his fake eye. He's <laughs> <laughs> just like. <laughs> That'd be <laughs> hilarious. That'd be hilarious. Hell yeah! <laughs> I just don't worry. I'll like... donate my bad eye. <laughs> your bad eye. You just got your eyes fixed. Yeah, no. One of them's degrading. <laughs> Already. <laughs> did, you ever, did you ever ask them for the touch up? Uh, I got to I gotta get a hold of them soon before the year's up. <laughs> you uh, you got like I got, you got like a you day. Got, like, you know, no, no, no. I mean like you're from the procedure. Oh, okay. Like, I was like, I was like, you only got like people or me less than a week. <laughs> so, all right, we're gonna take a quick break and we will be right back. There we so, go. You know, we're <laughs> back from our short intermission. Um, you mean the instant intermission that they get? Yeah, uh, it, was really like it doesn't matter. Uh, <laughs> all right, so we're back. We are going to stay with the topic of holidays, and we're going to talk about uh, some of the stuff we've seen in stores while shopping. Brennan and I used to work retail. Well, I still work retail. He left. Um, Fuck that shit. That's why I left. <laughs> yeah. Dude, no. Uh, Hell no. Nicole's worked in the service Hell industry no. a lot. A lot of <laughs> restaurants, stuff like that. So we've all seen a lot of stuff, especially around the holidays. It's It gets crazy. Um, I, <laughs> I don't know. Like, <laughs> what, like, what have you guys seen? I've seen, I've seen everything from, like, Walmart 
a mom and a daughter both in mark carts and you know how like they have like the four ways in the aisle mm. i've seen them one on either side and they're rolling around opposite <laughs> ways trying to find each other calling where are you and they're like i'm over here i'm over there like they're literally going around ones like this and they're just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> like he's just missing each other as they turn the corner <laughs> like it's so funny I mean, I've seen just about everything and anything because, let's be real, I was in Florida for a long time. <coughs> yes, you! <laughs> OTF! I just spit food. I saw everything fly everywhere and I ran for my life. <laughs> what was that? I don't know. Where did that come from? It just made it up. <laughs> Can I not do are that? You, are you sure that wasn't from like your favorite movie, Twister? Because that seems like a line from Twister. No? The Tornado uh, movie? Yeah. Oh, dude. <laughs> That's the best movie in the world! That's literally his favorite movie. I'm not even going to play with you. Like, my dream job would be a storm chaser, so... There you go. It's lit. What the fuck? It's lit. Yeah. Get out of my head. That's, that's Stop. Bree Timmer's, like, my hero. Do you know who that is? I do know who okay, that is. Okay, good. We almost just fought. You ever watch, uh, Pecos Hank? No. I took Get a look at him. Is that English? All right. Pecos Hank. You'll have to, like, message me the name, because yeah. I'm going to be able to type that. He's, he's got the best photography... Video capture everything I've ever seen in my entire life watching really? storm videos. He is the fucking god of it. I like get excited when we get rain. Oh my god. I'm like, I'll go to the beach when thunderstorms are coming in yeah. and just fucking wait. Right. I missed that fucking. He knows this story because he <laughs> texted me this one. Listen, I, I'm heading home from work. I worked in retail at the time. Uh, for Frito Lay, he was working for Pepsi. We used to call each other all the time because we had the same stores and we would just that, talk. Yeah, that's, that's how we met. <clears throat> so. I'm working, I'm just walking out the door, and I'm looking at my phone because I just check the radar all the time. And he's telling me he's up in Niagara Falls, and he's like, oh man, this, you know, there's a cloudy coming over, and like looks kind of creepy or something. I'm like, yeah, I'm looking at the radar, it looks, looks like a storm's coming, I didn't think anything of it. Fucking go home, fucking, I pass out as soon as I like, get in the house, I just lay on the bed, pass out. And I think I was asleep for 45 minutes, and in that 45 minutes, hey, he's what? back! Oh, hey. <laughs> In that 45 minutes, no, no. <laughs> fucking, uh, that single storm dropped the fucking tornado right in the Hamburg Fairgrounds. Right oh. over the fucking water and shit, too. Yeah, that's right, because it that tore straight from Hamburg it, all the way into Niagara Falls. Yep, I was Hamburg, pissed about that, because my fucking a, sister texted me about it, and she's like, dude, let's go. And I was like, I'm down. Do you understand? My out. life dream is to see a fucking tornado. And I, mean, I, I've seen them, but... I, I've never seen one in person. I've seen videos. I've never seen one in person. My life dream is to see that shit and record womp, myself. Womp, womp. Fucking You're in the wrong missed area it. For that shit. Oh, I know. I've mentioned that many <laughs> out there. We've been getting a lot recently for some reason. Global but warming. Fucking I missed it by like <laughs> 20 I missed it by like 20 minutes. I, if I would have drove out me. towards uh, fucking, uh, I forgot where I hit, like arcade after that. If I would have drove out, I could have caught up to it, but it was. Way too far from I would have laughed so hard if you drove out there. And, and you get sucked up in it. You're, like, you're <laughs> in the car, and you either get sucked up in it, or a fucking tree just crushes your car. Oh, yeah, that'd be oh, hilarious. It's like the fucking movie. Your car is like your life. You the love movie your Twister yeah. when they bring out the fucking cow. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, the here's, little here's the funny story about the Twister. Is, uh, after that how do, how do tornado... I don't, know. I don't fucking know. We went from, <laughs> we went from <laughs> holiday stories yeah. to uh, people of Walmart. I, just, I had to bring this up. So... Um, after that tornado came through, me and my cousin hopped in his car with cameras and everything. We went around trying to find all the damage. And we I, woo, I put it, woo. I put we got it. a nerd alert. We got a nerd alert. We woo. <laughs> <laughs> I put the video on YouTube on my channel, and for the thumbnail, I used the scene uh, where the cow's flying by, but because my channel's based on my car, it's a car channel, yeah. I took the cow, photoshopped it out, and put my car there so it was getting sucked up in the tornado. <laughs> Oh come on! It was hilarious. I loved it. How many video, how many views did you get of that? Um, I can tell you right now. Actually, not enough to monetize. No, I can't <laughs> monetize, motherfucker. I make money on that shit. Not a lot. So how many views you got? I probably got more views on my Crank That Soldier Boy video. Probably. I, I dance on YouTube to Crank That Soldier Boy. <laughs> <laughs> um, as I thought I was so cool. <laughs> Y'all do not try to look that up. <laughs> Four point one thousand. You had 4.1 thousand views. Yeah. Yeah, it's because it was a picture of your car. Hmm. I, I just wrote, we got hit by a tornado. And you fucking for- asshole. That's <laughs> why. You're a douche. That's why. You're we a get douche. hit by a tornado. We did. Everyone go dislike Brendan's 
page. You'll, you'll never find it. I'll never let you know. It's, it's literally it's Brendan called. Frost <laughs> ST. It's literally called. Or no, I'm sorry. Is it Brendo Frost <laughs> ST? No, Brendo ST. Oh, Brendo Fuck! ST. What is it? Everyone go dislike his page. Don't Aren't you that. demonetized anyway? No, I have enough. No, I got enough. You got now. back? Yeah, oh. I'm good. I'm good. I'm, I'm making my thirty bucks a month. <laughs> for my thirty shit. bucks a month. Listen, I haven't uploaded a video in like half a year, so. Cool. Rename your rename your page this week in foolishness. We'll just slide right just in. Just slide right in. Yeah. I was thinking <laughs> we could take a podcast and put it on there. I know. That's what I said we'll just we'll just live stream it on there. Shit. Yeah. Coming shortly, live streaming of the podcast. Yeah. You can listen on a, in on a page that so exciting has nothing to do with podcast. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, yeah. So we'll, we'll make a new one. So yeah, <laughs> we, I, I two yet have not seen a fucking tornado, and I've there's been multiple occasions where I could have seen one. Like when I was out in fucking Newburgh. Coming soon, live stream from inside a tornado. Oh, God. Yes! Yes! No. The, the fucking Newburgh one. Your mom probably told you about this. Uh, I think I messaged you as well. Yeah, I don't remember. So it was fish kill, fish kill Newburgh. Yeah, they yeah, had yeah. like three different fucking tornadoes hit that area. Yeah. And it was literally right through the, the airport that I was staying at. Yeah. Like right fucking through. And we, we couldn't get to work that night because the roads were all Wait, closed. And the right, let me ask you a question really quick. The one in uh, Windsor. Oh, Stewart. Windsor. Yeah, Stewart. Okay. Have you ever had a girlfriend? Yes. And you've been inside a tornado. You know why I'm pointing at you because you just got out of the tornado. <laughs> yes. Yes, I did. Amen, oh. motherfucker. Amen. God. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <you're so> low. <laughs> oh man! And oh, oh, and the, to top the fucking icing on the cake, my cousin. I'm at work, and we. It was just recently when we had those fucking water spouts popping up because it's yeah. just a tight season. He fucking caught one. He he saw it driving and going home or something. Drove straight up to the beach, fucking recorded it, and then sent it straight to me and says, "Ha ha, motherfucker! I can die happy." Like, you need to just go to Tennessee. Yeah. Oh like, no, Chattanooga. don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm going to take a vacation. I'm going to go straight one. to... I'm, <laughs> when I have money. I'm going to go on vacation. I'm going to ha- go to like, Oklahoma. Broke ass bitches. We go on vacation. Oh, yeah, we do no. podcasts. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah that's broke. my vacation. I just sit at home and fucking watch Netflix and podcasts. <laughs> so, all right. So, off the... Uh, I don't know the, what started that yeah, tangent. I'll have to re-listen to this to find out exactly, but... Off of the Twister... Best movie ever. Yeah, whatever. Back to the... Bill Paxton. Back, God back to the people of Walmart. Back to the people of Walmart. Like, oh, God. So, well, like, you've had you've had interactions with people at work, Brennan. What? Oh, God, yes. Thankfully, I've never had to service a Walmart. Really? On my, yeah, I never got a, a Walmart on my routes. This bitch's just... shirt says, Clit are us. <laughs> 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 like, with the like, Toys are us writing. <laughs> like, some of that shit is funny. Like, like... We were just talking because the holidays here, like super busy Phil and Pop. Oh yeah, super busy Phil and Pop. Like you said, like you like a couple years ago holidays, like you had people ripping chips yes. out of your hands. So I I did tops. And yeah. Tops had always has the fucking buy two get three free sales going on. So I would would be wouldn't be able to put stuff on the shelf as fast as they were taking it off. Eventually, it got to the point where as I'm trying to put them on the shelf, I got people like, oh I'll take that. Wham! Just rips it right out of my hand. I'm like. <laughs> Next person that fucking does that is gonna get this shoved right down his fucking throat. I hate that shit. I want. I'm. I hate people. I, yeah, I really yeah. do. So it wasn't the job. People for me. irritate me, but oh, I do the God. job. Yeah, because you get paid. Yeah. I mean, fuck. I'm like money. getting grossed out looking at these people at Walmart. <laughs> like, well, what, like, what do you have from holiday work stories? That is disgusting. <laughs> what? That's right up your alley, bro. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. There's more. Uh, no, thanks. But wait, I'm, there's I'm, more. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, um, there's more because we really gotta get rid of this. I really shit. like. I don't have any like crazy holiday stories from working. Like, well, you got you guys just horrible customer crazy. stories, don't you? Oh, I mean, a lot I, that actually, could be a whole episode yes. itself. Oh, yeah. All right, so we're gonna do one of those. I actually have that down on my list of topics. Yeah. Is like working. I know. I know. Brit- Brittany will have to be on that one because she's got a lot from her job. She's salon, right? I'll yeah, tell you this long. much, okay? Mother's Day. I was working at Mighty Taco two years ago, and Mother's I'm Day. I'm sorry. I was the only fucking mother working. I was the only bitch working. First of all, <laughs> it was all dudes, and I'm like, what the fuck? So this motherfucker comes through my drive-through. Now, mind you, I'm on drive-through. I ain't even making the food at this point. And he gets his food. I cash him out. 
and this motherfucker sits at the window, knocks on the window, tells me to come to the window, so I go to the window, see what he wants. He goes, this isn't what I ordered. This isn't your friend, right, from mm-hmm. last episode? He's like, <laughs> no, wait, it, 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 it's, it gets crazy, bro. So he's like, this isn't what I ordered. I'm like, I'm sorry, I can take him, fix it. This motherfucker throws an open-ass burrito at me through the drive through window. So my ass... I'm not a manager at this point. I was a manager at Mighty Taco, but not at this point. So, my dumb ass, I'm like, throw it back at him. I literally fucking, like, wound up and <laughs> threw that shit back. Heaved it. I said, I'm not a fucking manager. <laughs> that was... I, you know, I'm not fucking employed anymore. <laughs> well, like, I really thought I was losing my job that day. And, and, and then, guess what? A couple days later, I got a promotion to a manager. <laughs> Now I have the right to yes. do this. I, I don't have one about myself, but when I used to work at Strikers, my buddy Brandon that lived on, on my dad's street with me. Different one. Brandon, not Brandon. Different syllables. Yeah. I feel like I probably know who this is. No, you don't. Okay. Um, He was working at Strikers with me. And you know, you know, like, do you ever see those pictures where, like, the woman's got, like, the bob haircut and everyone says, this is the, can I speak to your manager yeah, haircut? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So this is what this lady looked like. And she, like, she was mad about something. I don't remember what it was. She walks up, she's like, can I speak to the manager? So Brandon literally, like, turns around, <laughs> turns back and goes, I am the manager. No. And, he, and he, he wasn't, I but I literally people. just <laughs> fucking <it up. laughs> standing there laughing. <laughs> just dead face, stone, just... I am the manager. <laughs> <laughs> we pulled so much shit. I am shit. Spartacus. We pulled so much shit there. Like, when we do the the work episode, I'm pretty sure Mike won't let me back in the in the facility after we do that because of the shit he'll find out we did. Don't do that. I know. I feel you. like we're all going to be out of a job after that episode. <laughs> like, <laughs> we're all going to get shit canned. <laughs> Every last one of us has a job until next week. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm pretty. I'm I'm good at my job now. I uh, I hold my tongue. I really do because there's a lot of customers that get I had a customer. Off. I had a customer fucking ask me if I was deaf. I was like, <laughs> I was like no, I'm just geez. ignoring you very loudly. This was like a week ago. I'm like, come got, the fuck again. I got <laughs> like, one. See? I have so I have so many. I gotta I gotta write them down for when we do this. Yeah. But like, I was telling I was telling Kate about this one. Some woman was like, she she came and like bought something. <laughs> Of mine, and then she was talking to me about it. Oh my god! So, all right, I'll, I'll read this. Nicole pulls up a picture from the People of Walmart page, and it's this guy wearing a black shirt that says, "I check off on titties, faces, and asses." <laughs> I think I need that shirt, what? guys. Like, I understand the society of not giving a fuck, but at what point do you draw a line <laughs> going out in public like that? We got god. Captain Crunch, too. That's I'm not playing. Jesus. Oh, my God. Is he black? <laughs> no, he's not. That would I, that would just make me super... That would have made it so much funnier if he was black. It would have made me uncomfortable. Like, <laughs> crunch and chocolate milk, man. How many pirates are black? This is my ship. <laughs> I'm the captain now. It's the little Somali guy in a Captain Crunch outfit. Someone should. I am the captain. Yeah. Now. Someone should go back and just Photoshop all of the scenes with him in it in a Captain Crunch outfit. That would be hilarious. Yo, oh, that should shit. be one of our podcasts where we just dress up and do some crazy shit in Walmart. <laughs> like, oh, shit. That ass. I have a. Uh, I don't think I brought it out here. Oh yes, I did. I have a. A portable recorder that we could do. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. And it's got a... That's just audio, right? Yeah. And it's got a... She's talking about cameras. Like, oh, oh yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I have two oh, professional... I, 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 I have two <laughs> professional DSLR cameras. Did you give me one of those? DSL cameras. DSL. <laughs> <Take second line. laughs> I actually have a third one. My niece has it next door. So we can each just carry one. <laughs> he said his neighbor got DSL. That's <laughs> 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 my neighbor. Did he just say his neighbor was his cousin, too? Yeah. Oh, oh. I mean, welcome to the oh. south. Oh. God. <laughs> Is she hot? I, I'm going to give you about three seconds to retract that statement before I tell you how old she is. How old is she? Oh, never mind. <laughs> wait, wait. I retract. Now we need to know. No, I'm okay, now bad already. Know. She's 13. Ah, <laughs> why? <laughs> What's wrong with you? What the fuck? You didn't tell me that beforehand. <laughs> I mean, some of them, you can't even tell these days, so. <laughs> God. Oh, shit, I forgot what your story was about. 
I, I don't know what my story was about. <laughs> it wasn't about ass titties. <laughs> no, it wasn't. Uh, uh, oh, that's what it was. So I'm working, filling pop, whatever. Woman comes up. Oh, by the way, we're from New York. We say pop instead of soda. Yeah, they know Western that. New York. They no. know that. We're from Canada. Canada. <laughs> yeah, they do. We said where we were the first episode. Listen, motherfucker. Not everybody listens to the first episode. Then maybe they go right to the third because fuck it. And you from, think I started from, from the dollop on number Buffalo. one? Yeah. Buffalo. Buffalo. Right next to Laport where all the nasty bitches are. We say sucker instead of lollipop. I didn't even know there was a thing. Yeah, apparently there's a thing. <laughs> no, I, when I was out... I thought I was the guy with fucking, all the dumb listen, facts. When I was in uh, Fun fact, Newburgh... Brennan is a nerd. <laughs> when I was in Newburgh, people kept asking me, oh, you're from Buffalo? So you say this instead of this? I'm like, yeah. What, you know what? people in New York City say coffee different? They say coffee. Well, that's just coffee. an accent. They're well, just that's, saying coffee. That, that's that's like, like Jersey. Or that's like... like um, Boston khakis. Uh, what is it? <laughs> uh, Philadelphia, where they say water. What? 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 A boot? A boot? A boot? Oh, sorry, a boot that. Sorry, boot that. I feel like I should be like, in a South Park. <laughs> With the fucking split up face. Flap and dance. So, so alright, back, back to the story. So, I'm literally, I'm filling stuff. Some woman buys something and she's like talking to me. And I literally. With just, a flappy head? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Like, pretty much. And I, I literally just. Stood there and like looked at her and just pretended like I was deaf. <laughs> and then she's like yapping, 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 yapping. And I'm like, and like I made it seem like I, feel like I was deaf. And she just turns around and walks away. <laughs> and my girlfriend's like, You did not. I was like, I did. And she's like, That's horrible. It's like she wasn't asking me anything good. She was just yapping about like. Finally, she was like, Oh, the point her. across, that's for sure. She was like, Oh, I'm buying this for a party. And oh, yeah, no, they ramble on about, about the stupidest blah, blah, blah. shit. Like, like, I don't give a fuck. Buy it and leave. Like, like the customers, they like actually come up and be like, Are you like, like, oh, do you guys still have this or whatever? Like, okay, that's, that's understandable. That's fine. But the customers that come up and like, you know, because stuff gets you discontinued. You have this because I need it for this and this. Yeah. Wearing a blue so, uniform in a store not, with black uniforms. Not only that. Like, no. So, like, if they're looking for, like, your own product, like, they'll come up and they'll ask, like, do you have Verner's in a two liter? And I'm like, sir, we haven't had Verner's in a two liter here in over a decade. He goes, that's not true. I just bought it here oh, the other week. I'm like, no, you didn't. I know what you're saying. The customer is always right, dude. No, no, you didn't. I've been oh, working here for seven years. The customer is never fucking no. right. I know, it's just a rule. <laughs> the customer is sometimes right, but most of the time you just tell him he's right. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, God. I want to bring up a story, but I won't. I'll save that for the re- actual retail episode, because it's a... Okay. It's a, it's a fucking... You know, like you know I'm, this story. I'm looking at a lot of asses and crotches. Like... Well, like, yeah. <laughs> Like, That's all it ever is. People, Walmart. Walmart. people at Walmart, like, it's super, like... You'll get the what, fattest person what, in the world in the skinniest, like, tightest clothing you can think of. What was the video? Of. The video was, they were talking about some store they were going to, and they're like, oh, yeah, this store is great, because you don't have to get all dressed up like you do to go to Walmart. And I'm like, <laughs> 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 dressed up to go to Walmart, because... Contrary to popular belief, she's got about 18 pages of pictures of people not dressed up to go Listen, to Walmart. I... I won't leave my house without like throwing re- generic pants like jeans or something on. You Walmart? Just, you just, just made fun of me yesterday. Yes. You know, like changed out of my sweatpants. No, I know. Movies. I know. His but shirt Walmart says, is the first store. Ready for this? It says beast. <coughs> His shirt says beast meat. <laughs> beast meat. Yo. Beast meat. There are some funny ass shirts. Walmart is the only store I've ever gone into with pajama pants on. Not giving a fuck. Not me. I just don't give I don't a fuck anymore. House, I don't leave the house in sweatpants or basketball shorts. It's always either, like, real shorts or pants. Like, it's n- I don't do basketball shorts. I don't know why. I feel vulnerable. Well, that's only you. <laughs> I don't know. That's just something... Right. You all right there? No, my chair, like... Oh, this guy's God. shirt says bowel blocker. <laughs> bowel blocker? <laughs> <laughs> Is he a kidney stone? <laughs> I feel like he means that he's pushing it back up. I guess. Ain't all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, shit. <laughs> Welcome to the show, guys. Uh, <laughs> God. Well, this this took a turn. Um, <laughs> we're, we're closing in here. I think we're going to wrap it up. Anyone got any... Final stories of the night. 
Uh, looking at me like I got something off the top of my head. I, I feel don't. like you should have something by now. Oh man, no, my you mind don't work like you, right now. My <laughs> mind don't work like you think it does. This was the most uneventful Brendan story Listen. ever. Sorry guys, I'll make up for it. This is Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> Push the button. Push the button. Which one? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, where's the Man, I'm really Wait, I found I found a SpongeBob. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, why is it on the Don't. back? <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever see the video of that woman at, like, I think she was at Burger King or, like, Mighty Taco or something, and she's got, like, the front butt, like, this huge <laughs> gut, like, tucked Ew. into her, like, oh. her, her spandex pants. Oh. I'm sorry, but, okay, there should be a weight limit on There, there <laughs> should be. Leggings and spandex, there should be a weight limit. Oh, God, that would be, like, that'd be. be like if I went and put, like, Leggings on and went outside. <laughs> okay, I, you, you, know, you, have, you have fat legs. Oh, so you're talking I, about. I don't, I don't. Like, even I have fairly normal no, legs. No, but like, like, if you, so if you, pull, if like you pull Like, if this up, bitch like, was wearing leggings, I would probably puke. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna puke looking at it now. <laughs> it's this picture of this huge lady with this ass the size of. It's not of, even a lady, it's a black chick. <laughs> it's trying to be a little PC. But I don't know why. <laughs> so, she's got an ass the size of, like, a lawnmower. Like, <laughs> It's literally Why is that the thing you go to? No, it's, it's literally like I was gonna say a bus, but it's not the size of a bus. It's literally like the width of a riding lawnmower. Like the two big tires in the back. <laughs> like it is. Wait, what's this one? Oh, I've seen that. Wait, what the fuck that's is that? Like, that's like some fucking what the shit? Star Trek shit. <laughs> uh, so this, this woman, I know we're doing we're doing pictures on an audio medium. Maybe where this guy saw the script. She's she looks like she's Latin. She looks, uh, that's I, I don't know Latin. what she looks like. Maybe. She, look, she looks like she's an alien. Let's be honest. <laughs> and she has these pencils in eyebrows, but where the eyebrows I come will together... I do my makeup like this and take a picture for you guys. <laughs> literally. So, from where the eyebrows start, where they're close together, they're, what would you say? That's probably two inches... It's like a unibrow without being a unibrow. <laughs> yeah, but they're, they're two inches thick in the middle, and then taper down to a pencil thin... Like they're just Listen, it's you gotta even, get the emotion even, across. But it's not even eyebrow shape, it's triangle. Yeah, it's like literally she looks like like <laughs> Nicole nailed it. Like it's from Star Trek. Like it's something what you would see in Star Trek or Star Wars. The Klingons. Klingons, um, that's the word I was like. Like when you do that thing with your fingers, that's yeah, how that, her eyebrows are. Vulcan. I can't do it. Vulcan. <laughs> <laughs> you got retard fingers. I got retard yeah. fingers, so but uh, like if you do that with your fingers, that's what her eyebrows look like. Like a giant triangle. Oh you got it! You said it! What the fuck is wrong with your fingers? Good thing you're not a lesbian. <laughs> I used to be once. <laughs> that comes with the blackout stories, guys. Oh, God. That's in a later episode. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to wrap this up. Uh, this was a great night. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, this, uh, our next episode will be up on Thursday. This will be out Thursday as well. Oh, wait. <laughs> what? What are you... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is his pants down and it's up his crack? Wait, what? Okay, so this guy's standing in... in this, this, is last, this is the last one. She's, this guy is standing in line at McDonald's. His pants are down, his underwear is down, and he has shoved a wet floor, wet floor, floor sign up his ass crack. What? And it's sticking out like a tail. It's hilarious. It's like, what the fuck? Like... <laughs> I promise you, the ads I get oh, on my phone in the upcoming shit. days are going to be retarded. Yeah. Listen, we're just going to have to do a video eventually with this podcast. We, well, with, yeah, but we can we can also we gotta show you these. I things. will post all these. We we can also yeah, you can post them on the on our Facebook page. Uh, you can find our Facebook page at This Week in Foolishness. <laughs> Somebody share some um, me stick. A in Twitter your page will be coming soon, and I think maybe. Maybe maybe I'll have Nicole make a, a this week in foolishness Snapchat so we can snap stuff out while we're doing it. I got it. you guys. Yeah. Twitter. So. Snapchat Nicole dot <laughs> <laughs> uh, Enjoy this week's episode, and we will see you next week. Boom.